Good evening, and thank you for sharing your space with me tonight. My name is Allison Pinkover, and I have been a member of the Brockton Mayor's Opioid Overdose Prevention Coalition for many years through my work as the Director of Substance Use Services at Brockton Neighborhood Health Center. For those of you who do not know the health center well, BNHC is a community health center in downtown Brockton. Our work is grounded in the value of health as a human right and centers our patients and community as the driving forces behind the care we provide. In addition to the many medical and behavioral health services BNHC offers, our substance use services department works both passionately and compassionately to provide support to people in every stage of their readiness to change. Since 2001, our department has provided medical care from a small clinic located inside of Father Bill's and Main Spring Shelter to meet the needs of those experiencing homelessness in downtown Brockton. In 2015, our services expanded to include an office-based addiction treatment program called the Harm Reduction Clinic, which now serves more than 400 patients per year with programming in English, Spanish, Cape Verdean, and Haitian Creole. We are proud to offer services beyond that of a traditional OBAT program by providing treatment for stimulant use alongside clinical care for those struggling with opioid and alcohol use. Then, in 2018, after identifying the need for services specifically tailored for pregnant and postpartum women, BNHC launched Moms Do Care. Moms Do Care supports the pregnancy and parenting journeys of those struggling with substance use. Through the work of peer moms in recovery and specialty trained staff in OBGYN, the program works to eliminate the stigma associated with pregnancy and substance use disorder and meet the unique needs of people navigating new parenthood and recovery. Finally, two years ago this week, with the help and collaboration of many familiar faces here, we launched our Community Care in Reach mobile addiction program to provide walk-in medical harm reduction and treatment services on demand throughout Brockton. Tonight, I have the honor of introducing someone who, like the Health Center, has deep roots in Brockton. Nan Garland Trenholm, a self-proclaimed Montello girl, was born and raised in Brockton. She is now a small business owner in neighboring Abington and is an active supporter of numerous peer-led community resources in the greater Brockton area. Tonight, Nan is bestowing upon us the privilege of hearing her story. As a woman approaching her sixth year in recovery, she also grieves as a mother who has lost a son, Stevie, to overdose. Tonight, however challenging, Nan courageously chooses to recover out loud. At a time where stigma still threatens our families, friends, neighbors, and communities, Nan and I agree that we can't stay silent. It's not an option. Bravely and graciously telling her story, please welcome Nan Garland Trenholm.